What if you had a stacked team on ALS completely stacked out, but then you didn't? For today's video, we are going to be starting from the very beginning of ALS with no units, no nothing, just, oh wait, wait, hold on. Okay, let me explain. All right, so I did try this on another account where I tried to get these units, these code units, but apparently the code doesn't work anymore or it just didn't work on that account. Maybe it still works. I'm still have the codes down on the bottom. So that's the reason why I do have some units in this account because it was a code unit. Okay, but first things first, we're going to put the rest of the codes that we haven't put in yet. So I'm going to leave all the codes in the description once again. If you guys want to use them, if you're new to the game, make sure to use those because they are really helpful. All right, so I was only able to get 6.8K gems, and uh, yeah, I think we should be good with that. Itachi's not the best unit to have right now. Maybe I'll summon for him like three times. Maybe I won't go over that. All right, let's go. Let's go with the first one and see what we get. Do we get anything good? Do we get decent? Oh, it's looking. I mean, we get Rukia. Rukia is actually pretty good. Uh, since she's a good um, stun unit, or she freezes units, I, I guess. So she could be good. She could be good. But let me get, let me get Itachi. I wouldn't mind an Itachi. Okay, we have. All right. It's the last, last one I'm going for, by the way. Okay, we get Pride. That's actually good. We get a money unit. We get a money unit. That is actually really good. Okay, but I actually do want Luffy at least. Okay. All right, so we don't get <laughs> uh, not even a legendary here. So we're going to take Pride in the team. We're going to obviously put Gogeta, Gohan, Nami, Rukia, and Kirito, I guess. Is Goku even better than him? I really don't know. I never really tried the rares like that. All right, so we're going to be finishing the first half of story, which is uh, Desert Village. We are going to be doing that right now. I'll be right back once I finish with that. Uh, I'm gonna see if we can do it in nightmare mode. That that is what I really want to know if I can do. All right, so we're gonna go and try this out, and I'll be right back when I finish this. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. We finished wave one. All right, so I had to back out of story for a minute. We made it to Act 4, and I think we're heading to Act 5 on Nightmare Mode. So it is pretty easy to solo story mode on Nightmare, even with these units. So it is possible to pass uh, the first map without having to have any mythicals. So I am going to summon for Yamamoto because he is really good. I am going to summon for him. We're going to probably do another 1500 for him. Let's see if we get him. Hopefully, we get at least a legendary. Uryu would be really good to have in the team right now. Oh, it's not looking good. Okay, we're gonna get pity for Uryu at least, so that's good at least. We're gonna have Uryu now in the team, and he's definitely gonna be a boost for the team. Oh my god, we have horrible luck on this account, I swear to god. Alright, so we're gonna put Uryu in the team instead of Kirito. Let's take him out and let's put him in. I don't know if he is better than Gogeta, but I'm gonna still keep using Gogeta for the story, and maybe later on I'll see if I use Uryu for anything. Also, did you guys see the new sneak they released on the Discord, bro? This looks absolutely fire, bro. You're not gonna fall on my toes! Telling you, bro, they're cooking right now. They're cooking right now. They're actually cooking. And hopefully, that Saitama update that they do is fire as hell. I think it's going to be by next weekend they drop that update. So if you guys are hyped, let me know in the comments. Because One Punch is one of my favorite animes. And if they drop that ultimate on my boy Saitama, you know I got to be the first one to get it. So yeah, let me know if you're hyped for that. I already beat it. Okay, buddy. All right, so we actually got to finishing uh, the story mode. So now we are going to go just fully go summon, see if we can get Yamamoto, because I really do need a Mythic for the next episode, and hopefully I do get Yama right now. Oh, please, let me get Yama, please. Oh, my 
god, the luck on this account is so bad, bro. Let's go. Let's actually go. Oh my god, we actually get Yama. And we didn't have to waste that many gems. We still have 3.7k. Let's go. Oh my god, that is a big boost. Alright, we're gonna take our Dream Nami. I'm sorry, but she is completely dog. And we're gonna put in my boy Yama. Let's go. All right, we're actually going to roll a technique on him. We have to. We have to roll five at least. Okay, hold up. We have to. Okay, hopefully, hopefully we get something good. We're only going to go five on him. Let's go. Cosmic. Bro, we got to keep that. We got to keep that, bro. Cosmic is actually really good. Like, I have to keep it. Now, as much as I really want to get something better. Let me see. Cosmic, 50% damage, 10% range. Yo, that's good. That's good. I got to keep that. Okay. All right, boys, I think I'm going to leave it on that. We finished the first map completely with just the basic units that they gave us with the codes. So it is possible to finish the first map. And now that we got Yama next episode, we're probably going to finish the second map and maybe even the third map and maybe get to Namek. So, yeah. I'm sorry that this video was really short. I'm, I'll try to make the next one longer. Uh, I just don't want to finish the game as quick, you know, because there is still not that much content for me to play. So I just don't want to go all out in one video. So, yeah, maybe next video we'll do a bit more than what we did in this video. Plus, we have Yama, so we should be good. Anyways, guys, if you guys like this video, make sure to hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel. And, yeah, I'll keep you guys updated on anything on Anime Clash.